What is going on guys, Sid here with another installment of Nostalgia Blast and if you guys have been following the channel, you guys know that we had jumped into Tekken 7. Guys, I got this game on sale obviously because Tekken 8 is going to drop in January I believe, right? Uh, you guys can double check me there, right? But it's been quite some time since, uh, uh, you know, I, I, I checked anything Tekken related, right? Up until this point in time, right? But guys, um... This is a Nostalgia Blast episode, and guys, if you missed the previous episode, you can uh, you can duly check that out, right? But um, guys, right now we're jumping back in, and it's been years, absolute years, since I've played a Tekken game, right? An iteration, but uh, I did have like three main characters that I was like juggling back and forth in the la uh, from the last Tekken game that I played, which was quite some time ago, right? Probably PlayStation Three days, right? So. I was juggling back and forth between Horang, Kazuya, and Jin. Those were my three main characters. But, I'll, but, but Horang has actually been the the Tekken character that I've used the longest, right? So it's a, like uh, if you missed the rationale in the last video, I'll just tell you guys like flat out. It's probably because it's it's the easiest learning curve for me, right? Uh, in terms of like learning curve to relearn Horang, right? That's why we're using Horang, right? And I figured, why not climb into, you know, test out the online mode a little bit more, right? And I gave myself a couple of wild days, right, to jump back into the Tekken universe, customize my character, right, and uh, get get a nice little, uh, like, get, get some momentum, right, in my playing, right? And, uh, guys, today I jumped in, and uh, this is how I fared, right, well, um from my matches that I played today, right? So, uh, uh, before I even hit the record button, right, uh, I came across a Zhao Yu player, and uh, it's just odd, right? I, I, I matched with a Zhao Yu player twice today, right? Uh, normally, I, I, normally, I don't see a lot of people using Zhao Yu, right, uh, in, in Tekken games, right? The, obviously, the ones that do use Zhao Yu, they're, they're, they're good, right? But it's been ages it's been ages since i've seen like a lot of a lot of these characters right but um i think the biggest issue for me jumping back into uh, any tekken game right is probably like from a defensive standpoint right uh learning my opponent's moves right and, and just uh understanding how they move in the game right and obviously there's been a lot of new additions uh, uh, to the roster in tekken 7 right a lot of characters that i have i flat out don't know right and uh it's just absolutely wild because I've been away, I've been absent from the Tekken universe for such a long time, right? I had to get caught up on the lore, I had to get caught up on how Horang uh, changed, right? His combo, his combo set changed, right? And uh, his move list. And um, the fact that they implemented Rage Heart, right? So, um, I was like scratching my head, right? I, I was also lazy, but I was like scratching my head as to how to complete Rage Art, right? In a Tekken game, right? I was like, um, the last time I played Tekken, right? Um, I, Rage Mode was uh, like, like, like new, right? Um, so you, that that's a hint to the last time I played Tekken, right? Um, but the Rage Art sequence, right? Uh, the special move uh, sequence, right? That was not, uh a part of the Tekken universe for me, right? So it's been quite some time, right? So I didn't know, I didn't know, and you guys are a bunch of trolls in the community, right? So I was just like, uh, when I started like looking up, right? Because I didn't want to like go through like the tutorials like on the game, right? I just wanted to like quickly just browse my phone, and you guys are a bunch of trolls like in this community, right? So I'm just like checking, I'm checking online, and uh, I'm like, how do I do this special move? How do I do this special move, right? Because everyone's been whooping my behind, right? When they get when they get down to the to that part of the, the, their meter, right? Right here, right? They, they're all completing like special move rage arts and quite, quite quite simply like equalizing the game, right? For themselves, right? So I was like figuring, how do I do that, right? When I'm in danger territory, right? So I went online, I went to a couple reddits, right? And I went to a couple YouTube comments and they're like all like, oh, you gotta do this combination of moves, this combination. I'm like, huh? Huh, right and then one one person in the in the comments they were like um I, I can't remember the video but I just clicked on a random video and one person actually replied to someone asking how to do the, one of the rage art sequences it was like yeah you have to like get a DL you have to download a DLC right buy and purchase a DLC off the, the PlayStation I'm like huh that doesn't make any sense right 
And obviously, there's a lot of trolling in this community, right? And then finally, someone just replies, like, dude, just hit R1. And I'm just like, oh, so that's how you do it. And there you go, right? There's that. Uh, it segues perfectly into Zhao Yu's Rage Art, right? So, um, I'm new to this, right? Obviously, if you're a seasoned Tekken player, this is gonna be like next to nothing. Like, oh, he's only learning this now, right? Like, you're gonna have like this type of like. You know, like, uh, like, like behavior, right, or response to my videos, right, because obviously I have not played Tekken in so freaking long. I'm trying to just, like, literally, like, update myself to how Orang's moving, right, but from a defensive standpoint, like I'm saying, right, it's crazy because, like, there's that Rage Art again, right, so it's, it's crazy because, like, I'm playing, right, and, uh, you have to memorize their moveset, their combos, right, so to, to know where's your openings, right, and where to block, right, so, um, yeah, I took a lot of L's before making this video, right, and I just got up today, and I was like, um, I don't know if it's gonna be, like, a day, like, from the previous video to now, I don't know if this is gonna be, like, a good day or bad day in the Tekken universe, right, because I went on a win streak, I got up to Grandmaster, right, in the short, granted, the limited amount of time I'm playing, right, that, that's, that seems quite decent, I would say, right, but then I, like, looked up, like, um, like all of the the rankings and i'm like there's over like 50 rankings right like and i'm just like oh, oh okay <laughs> that, 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 well i suck no 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 you obviously have to be playing for quite some time in the Tekken universe right so you get those rankings right so um here you see like for example this guy that we're facing right now rebel amish radio right so i faced him uh i believe like probably like like yesterday i faced him right or like a day and a half ago i want to say right and he's really good right there's a lot of really good players like te in the tekken universe that i've matched up against and i figured okay you know what uh let's upload a video with him uh using paul right um my opponent right um so kudos to all of my opponents in uh, that I faced thus far in the Tekken universe, right online, right. Um, it's been it's been a blast. It's been a blast to jump back in, right. And the connection, for the most part, has been pretty. Uh, it's been pretty stable given the parameters that I set, right. Um, so I'm only face, uh, you know, like I'm facing. Uh, uh, like I want to say, like on average, uh, probably like thirty. Probably like uh, it fluctuates from 30 to 50, right, milliseconds, right? So that's usually my ping, right? So um, it's not bad. It's absolutely workable online, right? I know in the previous video, right, we, we saw all that delay and all that lag, right? But once you set the parameters correctly, right, um, it's not that big of a deal. The only thing is, right, for me, like I have to like relearn everyone's move list, right? In, in order to play uh, consistently in this universe, right? Because Tekken has like a steep learning curve, right? Uh, whether you're or an offensive player, a defensive player, right? And um, like literally, right? Like I'm just like, I think this is the first time um, uh, I, I faced this opponent using Paul, right? So obviously he is probably talented with like a lot of players, right? Probably uh, Paul's probably not his main character. He's probably like a secondary character, right? Uh, the, the guys that are used to facing this community, right? They'll be like, okay, who's your secondary? You've got Harang, who's your secondary? Who's your third, right? You always have to have like, like three or four characters, right? Um, and it makes the game that much more interesting, right? So it's been quite some time, probably like high school days, like probably like senior year in high school, I was like playing Tekken, right? Like religiously, right? And all of my friends from the high school era, they used to just like, tell you like the segues perfectly right they used to play me right at home right when we just like you know like uh without connection issues right and like no perfect no perfect no perfect right this was when Horang's combos were drastically different right so um i'm still in the process of learning Horang, right uh that's what i want to say there but yeah guys I'm having a blast playing Tekken, right? But win or lose, right? Uh, it's been it's been an experience, right? Like I'd go on like a five fight win streak, and then I'd go on a five fight losing streak. Obviously, there's a stamina issue there, right? Because this all involves like very fast responsiveness on your part, right? Like play a Tekken game in the Tekken universe against all Tekken pros, right? Um, or professional Tekken players, or you know, like esports level uh, guys, right? They're going to have their fast switch, like, 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 responsiveness, 
like set right and they're gonna have like you know like they're just gonna be playing at the correct tempo all the time and i'm still adjusting i'm, I'm like readjusting right now right i'm just like oh my god oh am i gonna stay in the second game course again probably We'll, set, we'll, we'll probably jump back in in January, right? Uh, plus, like I'm saying, right? Like uh, in terms of like scheduling, I've got like, a lot of things on my plate, and uh, I've got I've, I'm still like like on the channel. I've mentioned in previous videos, I've got to work on my health, right? Uh, there's my rage art, right? I got him, got it perfectly, right? Uh, did it save me in this round? Right? I got really low. Let me see, did I win? Yeah, I got that. Oh, ha. Huh. That, I think that was like the most satisfying win of the matches that I jumped into today, right? Um, what you're not gonna see, right? Um, just for time's sakes, I ha I whittled this down, right? I skipped my last opponent. I actually faced three opponents today, right? And uh, the third opponent that I uh, faced uh, today was using Brian, right? Um, and anyone who uses Brian in the Tekken in the Tekken universe, right? Uh, other Tekken players know it, right? Um. There's been uh, iterations of the game where Brian's been like Brian usually wins in the pro, the pro level tournaments, right? Um, he's just like one of those characters that are very high tier, right? So a Brian player, uh, when, whenever you're matching up against Brian players, you really do struggle, right? Well, if you're a harangue player, like uh, odds are you'll struggle, right? Maybe you know what? Let me just speak for myself, right? Because there's probably a lot of players that can. Right, uh, like easily match up, like much more higher, higher ranked players, obviously. But um, yeah, I get you get my drift, right? For rank, uh, uh, Brian players are up there in terms of like the tier, right? Um, I want to say Kazuya as well. Right? He's also a high tier player, but I think so far, so far for me, right? I believe the toughest player, right? Um, that I faced. The toughest opponent that I faced in Tekken 7 online so far has been like the law players, right? Um, the toughest opponent has always been a person using martial law, right? For some reason, martial law is extremely fluid, extremely responsive, extremely cheesy, right? But um, extremely powerful. He's very OP, right? So um, blocking against him, I'm still working on. Right, but um, and, and, and just figuring out my openings, right? A lot of new players added a, a, as well, right? And figuring out where's your opening, right? Especially when you're on the back foot and when you're defending, right? It's it's, it's it, it was like really troubling for me, right? Uh, but it's all a part of the learning process in tech, right? So it's 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 what makes it fun, right? And uh, yeah, right. I have a promotion chance here, right? And I'm up to grandmaster. Right, um, as you can see on the side of, um, I, I got up to Grandmaster, like, um, I want to say, like, last night, no, um, last night, uh, I, I went up to Grandmaster, and then I lost the ranking, right, I went on a losing streak, right, so, whatever you see here, it's gonna be, like, you know, like, this is my most recent ranking, right, and, like, right after this match, I did face, like, a Brian player, and the Brian player, um, he won one, right, because he was, like, insanely good defensively, and then I won the final match, right, and then I had to, like, make, like, the executive decision, like, right there, should I include it in the video, right, because I didn't give him the third match, right, it's not customary, it's not fair, it's not polite to your opponent, it's not in good sportsmanship either, right, um, to just, like, leave like that, right, um, but I had to, like, use the bathroom, <laughs> right, and I had been playing for 30 minutes at that point, right, the runtime of the video would have been 30 minutes, and then I just had to, like, decide, should I, like, keep that that clip right so after the poll after the poll fights with rebel Amish radio i did face someone else right and um i lost my first match and then i won the second match so that's where i actually am but guys check out paul's rage art right there Ooh. takes me down i thought he was, he was gonna do more damage right but he did the lunging kick and yeah i lost right but these were the, the the most fun matches of today, right? Playing against this this opponent, right? So I requested my revenge match, right? And uh, yeah, we're 14 minutes in on the video. Thing about Tekken, right? You're processing so much information on the fly at such a high tempo. You really don't notice. You really, really don't notice like the time, right? Uh, like you you experience time so much differently than uh, 
when you're playing a FIFA match, right? Because you're playing at naturally a higher tempo and the matches are much faster. They're at such a higher tempo, they're longer, they're they're long matches, right? And um no including the revenge matches, right? And uh, you're processing information at such a high speed, right? Same thing with Marvel vs. Capcom games, right? Same thing with almost any fighting game, right? But um, for me, like Tekken is just like, so super fast. It doesn't look so on on the screen, but you're you're processing information so fast compared to like the FIFA universe, right? Uh, where you know, like like you can just like let AI, you can you can let AI do some of the work sometimes. You can take your foot off the gas in terms of like how you approach FIFA, right? And um, yeah, like it's it's completely different fighting games that are just like faster all the time, all the time, all the time, right? Um, first person shooters are the same. Right? Um, but they require you to play at, at a higher, higher speed, right? Yeah. yeah, so it's like a lot of processing is what I'm trying to say, right? Uh, and you really, yeah, you really don't notice the time go by, right? So I could have easily, I could have easily made this. Oh, let me just check this mic. Yeah, I could have like easily, I don't know, like, you know, say to myself, oh man, I just spoke to so, uh, yeah, so, uh, yeah, you don't notice. You really don't notice. Like, I made, like, a 30-minute video, right? Uh, like, this would have been a 30-minute video, but obviously I left out the Brian portion of it. Right? Get ready for the next battle, 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 right? Um, but I had so much fun with the Paul portion that it kind of makes up for it anyway, right? Um, uh, because, uh, this opponent, I really love facing him, right? Rebel Amish Radio. So, kudos to my opponent, right? Um, it was, like... It felt really good. It felt really good playing against him. And uh, as you can see, like, it's a promotion match, no pain, right? No uh, and Round the question one. is, can I get the promotion, Fight. right? Because I'm at 7 Dan, right? The Grandmaster, right? He's that extra, right? And he's just like, ugh. Guys, look at it. I just got my butt handed to me, Round right? Two. By a Paul player, right? Fight. And uh, that's like, this is like the first second where I've gotten my butt handed to me. By a player, 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 player. So obviously, um, I've got a lot of work to do, right, in terms of like, learning my opponent's games, right? So yeah, um, boom. <sighs> right? So yeah, my opponent was giving me quite some time, right? Like, 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 guys. I, I got cornered right in the first two rounds, right? So I had my promotion chance, right? And uh, yeah, he did not let up, right? He did not let up, right? And it just felt right. It felt right to give him, give my opponent like the best of luck, right? Um, because we went back and forth, right? Obviously, it's customary. You know, like you best of three or you lose when you're up to. Right, two matches in a row. You don't know just like one minute, right? Because things like like people try to get accustomed to your play style and things like that. There's just like good sportsmanship. Like uh, like, like it's like in, in all games, all competitive games, like, there's like sportsmanship like criteria that you know, like you know like it's, it's not. It's, it's, it's frowned upon right, if you do something like if you win one match and you like lose or something like that. Right? And you don't give them the rematch. Right? Especially, like, you know, like, there's, like, there's, like, some, like, connection issues and things like that. And people are trying to get warmed up. So, you kind of, like, make it best of threes, you make it best of fives, you make it best of sevens, right? Um, you don't, you don't just, like, leave over, right? It's just not cool, right? You kind of develop a reputation when you do things like that, right? So, um, I wanted to, like, pose up this video, giving my opponent as many chances as possible as well, and showing you guys, like, like, you know, I'm not one of those, you know, who's just gonna, like, win one match and be like, oh, yeah, no. No, it's a, it kind of ruins the fun factor of the game, right? So, uh, I've been having a lot of fun is what I'm trying no to pain, get at, no right? And, uh, I wanted to give some fun to uh, the Tekken universe and give to the Tekken players in the universe, right? So, um, I know the, the, like, I'm, like, guys, I'm 100%, like, even though I'm an athlete, I'm also a nerd at heart, like, I'm a nerd. Right, so um, and there's nothing wrong with that, right? Uh, like, 
So, I, you know, whether it's FIFA, whether it's EAFC, whether it's Call of Duty, whether it's a first person shooter, whether it's Quake, whether it's Tekken, right, whether it's Marvel vs. Capcom, any of the games that you play online, multiplayer, you name it, right, I'm right there with you guys, right, you know, gears, right, right there with you guys, right, and, uh, it's good time, so, yeah, like I was saying, right, I do have to focus on my health, so the videos are not gonna be out, um, as a, with the same, like, level of frequency months, right, um, and I don't wanna just, like, abandon the channel completely Round either, three. right, but my health really just, like, that's, you know, just, just by, um, so right now, like, jumping into, like, a single Tekken, match online just felt right that because my butt handed to me by Paul, right? Our Round Amish four. radio is doing a number on me, right? But it feels like um it feels like I'm almost there, right? So in any case guys, we're coming to the end of this video. Um peace love all the blessings to you and yours. Make sure you leave some love on the channel guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Sid out. Ah uh, that was freaking fun today. Woo! And that was it. <laughs>